watching another episode of ABA Wednesday. Today's episode is going to be about love, my favorite subject of all time. I absolutely love to talk about love. Over the past few years, I've received thousands of questions from men and women around the world asking me relationship-oriented questions. After a while, I have come to realize that people don't really have issues with their relationships and not knowing what to do in their relationships. In reality, people have issues with not knowing what love is. Most people out there have no idea and are completely clueless about what real love is and means. So I thought I'd make a video about uh, what love is and share it with all of you five things that you should and everyone should know about love. So let's begin. The first thing that you should know about love is that it allows you to see a person in their real and true nature, in their real essence. When you are looking at someone through the eyes of love, you are looking at them in their real essence and true nature, which is perfection. See, a lot of people say that no one is perfect, nobody's perfect in the world. Well, I say that it's absolutely not true because in reality, it's the opposite. We are all perfect in our own ways. So I want you to think about when you uh, first fell in love with your boyfriend, girlfriend, spouse, whatever. Think about the first few months or maybe think about a great love that you had in your life. Maybe it was your first love and think about the beginning of the relationship when you started really to date and everything. I want you to ask yourself, did you tell your friends at that time, and I'm pretty sure the answer is yes, did you say to them, oh my God, he's so perfect, or she's so perfect? Well, that's because love allows you to see the other person in their real essence, in their real nature, which is perfection. We are all perfect. In, inside of us, we are all, all perfect. So that's the first thing that you should know about love. The second thing that you should know about love is that love is quiet. Love is silence. Love doesn't make a lot of noise and evil, uh, fear, hatred. It's very, very loud. So think about it, you know, a bomb, it makes a lot of noise but a child that's being born, it doesn't make that much noise. I think that we live in a generation and in a time where a lot of people are in fear. We're in fear of getting sick, of having cancer, of uh, being raped or kidnapped. You know, there's so much, so much fear in the air. And I believe that the only reason why there is so much fear in the air is because of the media, because of the news, because they're always bombarding us with all this negativity. So it makes us believe that the world that we live in, there's a lot more negative and a lot more evil, a lot more fear than there is love, which is not true. You know, even if there is a bomb that explodes somewhere once in a while, there's still so many more children that are born, you know, at the same time. So the first thing that, the second thing, I mean, that you should know about love is that it is quiet. It doesn't make a lot of noise, but it is still powerful. Love will always and forever be the most powerful force in the universe. There's no hurricane, there's no tornado, there's no bomb, there's no war that's more powerful than love itself. The third thing that you should know about love, and this is so, so important because so many people are confused when it comes to this, is that love, when you love someone, and when you're in a love relationship with another person, you cannot feel any negative feeling towards the other person. So you cannot feel fear, like, oh, I'm, I'm afraid he's gonna leave me. You cannot feel uh, hatred, oh, I hate him. You know, I hate him, I love him. It's a hate and love relationship. That's not true, that doesn't exist. Because in reality, if you feel that way about your partner, then you're not in a love relationship. You're in a, an illusion relationship. It's an illusion. You are not in real love. Real love doesn't hurt. Real love is not violent. Real love is not fearful. Real love is love. And love is the highest frequency. It's the best feeling, really, that a human being can feel. So you cannot feel love and hate at the same time. That's an illusion. That's not true. So stop saying that you're in love because you're in an illusion in reality. The fourth thing that you should know about love is that love is a feeling. We all know that, right? But since love is a feeling, then it is something that you can create by yourself. There is no one who can come in your life and create love for you. It is something that you create for yourself. There is nothing and no one in the world that can make you feel a certain way without you allowing that person to make you feel a certain way, right? Now, I'm going to give you an example. If, let's say, you're having a great day, best day of your life, you feel great, you feel very excited, you feel motivated, and then all of a sudden, radio is on, a song starts playing, it's a song that reminds you of a very sad event that happened in the past, and boom, 
all of a sudden, in less than a few seconds really, you change from being motivated, happy, uh, grateful, to feeling sad, depressed. What happened there? Is there an event that happened in your life at that present moment? No. It's a memory. It's something that's in your head that caused you to feel all of a sudden depressed and sad. So any emotion that you feel in your life is something that you create for yourself. When you first meet someone and you're all of the time listening to love songs and feeling happy, you are creating love inside of yourself. So love is a feeling you create it. So stop waiting for someone to walk in your life and to create love in your life. It's something that you can do right now, really. And the fifth thing that you should know about love is that love and all loves are all the same. So what do I mean by that? The love that you feel for your parents is the same love that you feel for your partner. Yes, I said it. A lot of you are probably like, no, that's impossible. Come on. But it is true. The love that you feel for, for your parents, for your kids, for your uh, neighbor is all the same love. It's all, all the same love. But the love that you feel for your parents is combined with uh, maybe friendship, maybe uh, gratefulness towards them for what they've done to you, uh, for you, I mean. And the love that you feel for your partner is a love mixed with passion, with uh, physical attraction. So all loves really that you feel is the same love all of the loves are the same loves it's just that it's combined with another uh, way of feeling it's combined with something else so that is it i hope that this video helped you understand a little more what love is and what love means in reality you have to understand that love is the greatest most amazing way of feeling it's something that you create for yourself it's the greatest force, of course, in the universe. And you have to really understand that love, it never hurts. It is never violent. Uh, you can never feel love and hate at the same time. That's just impossible. So I really hope it helped. Like I said, don't forget to share the video if you like and if you want the world to know what real love is. You can also like the video. You can also subscribe for new videos every single Wednesday. And you can also go on my website, alexandravillawell.com, for more tips and tricks on how to live the life of your dreams. My name is Alexandra Villarreal Abrego and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.